Surrounded by loyal constituents from Makati and members of the Philippine Marines, it is easy to forget that Vice President Jejo Marbinay is in the middle of a huge political storm. On his 72nd birthday, Binay spends the morning jogging with members of the Philippine Marines at their headquarters in Taguig City. Binay is a reservist in the Marines with the rank of Colonel. The day before, he goes back home to his bailiwick to attend the Thanksgiving Mass at the Makati City Hall. His birthday is not just a celebration. This is a politically savvy man at his element. In the past few months, Binay has had little to be thankful for, at least politically. While he remains a top presidential pick for 2016 based on nationwide surveys, his ratings have slipped considerably, no thanks to plunder raps against him and his son, and the Senate probe into corruption allegations against him. The vice president has denied all the allegations and says his detractors only want to pin him down in time for the 2016 elections. He has also backed out of planned debate against Senator Antonio Tullianes IV, one of the senators leading the probe against him. After all, Bine tells reporters, the worst is over. To be more accurate, it's waning. It's weakening. Marami pang ipupukol, pero they had veered towards, you know, ang ano doon, ang kalakasan doon is factual. There is the building, investigated, pero napupunta na sila sa Rappler, Manila.